Lazy Bird, welcome back to Pikmin 4. In the last episode, we started our adventure through the mysterious cave and it earned up the white key, the white jewel, the white Pikmin onion. I'm so glad that we were able to unlock that. And I can only guess that the purple onion is waiting for us at the end of this somehow. So we're gonna be getting started with the sixth story, the gimmick gambit. With this one, we need to reach a sage leaf. Can you outsmart the gimmicks and defeat the gambit? Show me the extent of your wits. All right, let's give it a try. Let's continue the mysterious cave. All right, let's see how this goes then. Ready and let's get running. So let's we'll see your Dandori practice in action. I can't get up there. Definitely start to get into the roof of everything and figure out everything. Check out the area with the survey drone. Okay, so I guess Shepard's watching us. Um, I'm a little confused. That door is blocking us. I can't quite get up there but I guess I can maybe throw some Pikmin to that. That might be my best bet. I don't see anything else we can really do at the moment. So that's the, the strategy I'm going to try. That'll be five Pikmin that we need for that. They're gonna fly over here and push that over. Come on, go, go, go. Once they do that, I can just climb up. Get everybody else and we'll try. No, no, not that. Okay, Uh, why else would I wanna be up there? I'm a little confused. Let me reset. Okay, so what I think I was supposed to do is get those five Pikmin up there. They're gonna push that rope down. We climb up as soon as it lets us, but instead of uh, trying to jump down ourselves, we'll just do that so that they can lower that door. Okay, that feels like a better idea to me. We can call some of them over and they should, oh no. Okay, I thought they would jump down to this way. It looks like we can move the ship over here for better or for worse. I really don't know what that'll do in this situation. Cause we're just trying to unlock different gates. Like that's our number one goal at the moment. I don't know what this really does, but I can go up here and then I can do that. Okay, I guess with enough treasures, maybe there's something we can get done. Um, they can work on destroying that thing and hopefully not get frozen. They might get frozen. Oh, they got frozen. All right, uh, call them back over. And then I guess over here too. Oh, I see, I see. So they'll run over, bring that golf ball in. I guess with maybe enough treasures collected, something else will happen. Um, think about the order of your tasks now. I'm trying my best. I don't see anything else to really get to that I can reach. I can't reach those. Um, getting up there won't help me too much. So it's down to one now though. Oh, there's a treasure up that way. Oh yeah, I see, I see. So let's charge up. Go over here, boom, get that knocked down. That was pretty good. So let's do that for sure. We're down to two and a half minutes now. So this might still be one that I'll have to redo at some point. Okay, but for now, we're just gonna go through with our whole group over this way. We have two out of the five gates unlocked. I'm just going to do that. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Try to run from you maybe? Okay, that could have been worse. I can't quite break that, okay. Um, I can use creatures too? Why would I use a creature here? I mean, I guess I could use could have used it to explode it, which I guess is what I have to do. Everybody, please. That didn't work. Okay, very unfortunate. I lost some Pikmin. I have a feeling that's really not what I was supposed to do. I need to get them to explode it, but I feel so weird. So let's restart, restart, and try that again. Okay, so what I'm trying to do this time and I have a lot more time, so hopefully this works out well and I don't lose all my Pikmin, as that has happened recently. Okay, see that explosion wasn't enough, which is very defeating, but if I could just get them to drop another one, it really just burn up a lot of time just waiting around for this, but I just need you to, come on, get over here, and then, there we go, that should be good enough. It explodes the wall, exactly what we wanted. We'll catch these five Pikmin, and we can get me through the next gate. So one, two, and three. I need to move this for some reason. Okay, um, I guess I just really have to pay attention to like what exactly we're doing here, because it looks like they're going to bounce like that. Okay, ooh, just barely got that one in time. And I guess they bounce over there. And then I think I have to turn it so that they bounce up that way, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, okay, they got the button pressed. That's actually really, really good. They're riding that down, so I guess we'll meet up with them over here. Is that the last gate too? It is, so that actually worked out really well. There wasn't too much more to do after that. We got it done. Very cool. So that was definitely a challenge, but we made our way through, and we got our sixth story, the gimmick gimmick, completed with a whopping two minutes and two seconds left over. Was that, was that a platinum? I sure hope so. Guess we'll see soon enough, but. Yes, it is. Awesome. So, took a couple of tries for sure, but we got through that one. 
Was that too easy for you? Well then, things are about to get less easy. We'll see about that. Let's proceed to the next thing. So the next one, seventh story is one fell jump. Ready? Okay, uh, what do we do here? Please show me your skills. Like, shouldn't I? Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What are we even doing here? Um, did we lose Pikmin already? I think I might have. I'm a little confused at the moment. Uh, okay, charging through like that might not be the best idea. Yeah, we're losing Pikmin. So, it seems like, yeah, the purple Pikmin, okay, shake this guy off. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. We're already down to two. They have like that big area of effect slam. So what I think we should do, there's so many enemies. Oh my gosh, we're just gonna defeat 99 of these guys. So, restore really quickly, because that was a disaster. Defeat all the creatures in one fell jump. I will just send Ochi out there, and then we will just, there we go, call them back over, so I can just keep throwing some more of them, and hope that like, none of them get beat up. Okay, so far so good. All right, so far it feels like we're doing pretty well with this. All right, Ochi, help out too. Oh no, oh, but they get gobbled up so fast, so fast. Keep helping, Ochi. Man, that's crazy. We're down the one purple Pikmin already. Uh, I guess, toss it over there. How many more enemies do we have left at a feet, though, is the question. Okay, that didn't do too much. Uh, and I can, you know, punch a couple of them, too. I gotta keep in mind. Maybe not the most effective thing to do. Ah, oh, there goes our other purple Pikmin. So, at this point, with 10 seconds remaining, I don't think I can do it. Uh, I'm trying to just punch through them now. <laughs> But we got pretty close, we got to 80. So if I could just keep that up and try to avoid my little teammates getting knocked out, I could probably do a little bit better. So that didn't quite count. Oh, is it gonna give me a lecture? Oh, now I didn't do well. I'm very disappointed in you. Your Dandori abilities are far from impressive. I mean, I don't know if that one was entirely my fault. <laughs> it's a very weird one. Okay. So like, what if I hopped on the Ochi and charged through a bunch of them first? I don't know if that's actually a good idea, but I mean, it gets rid of some of them. Okay, call them all over, just like that. And then call them back over, come on, come on. Just trying to make the most of our time here. Ooh, one of them got attacked, but where? I don't know. More of them are like falling from the sky, it seems, or something. Maybe we lost one. I don't even see where we're losing them exactly. It's these little grubs over here that can, can become such an issue. Ochi help out with that. I got 20 seconds left here. I still have so many more left to destroy. I just need to start throwing them like crazy, it feels. Okay, come on. Not good. Uh, got it, got it. Because it's the throw that really makes the big difference. We're at 86 now, I might be able to do it. Come on, 90, not 91, out of 99. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, I'm so close, yet so far. Four more remaining. It's just about constantly throwing them, but getting them to come back is really challenging. So I'm getting there, it's just not quite it. So restart, we'll try it one more time here. This might be it. Here's open. So, I don't think the charge that I did with Ochi before really helped too much. So I'm trying to pace myself a little bit, but then that just results in me losing some. And it's just, there's so much going on on the screen that I can't even really tell exactly where we're losing them. I think what the problem is, right, is that as soon as I throw them, it doesn't get every single one of them, and then a grub runs up and knocks one out. Gotcha, so call them back instantly after throwing them. Okay, Ochi, help out. And we're not losing any more now, so this might have been the better idea. Okay, maybe we lost one, hard to tell. 20 seconds remaining. Ooh. Got it. Call them all back. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, oh, we lost one again. See what happens there? Okay, come on. Did I lose another one? I'm trying to call them back. Come on, just a few more. Come on. 96 out of 99, so one more than last time. It's so challenging. It seems to be going a lot better this time. I'm trying to just keep in mind how the purple Pikmin work. And then I think we just lost one there, but overall not too bad, but then I lost a bunch, right? I don't know, I just lost one. Because sometimes they'll scream because they get picked up, but it doesn't mean that they're entirely knocked out. So that was pretty good. 
Come on, come on. That wasn't so bad. I just don't want to throw a bunch of purple Pikmin all on the same one, because that does just not get us too much done. Okay, over, where? There's a couple of little ones now running around. What are we missing, what are we missing? Is it you? I think you're the last one. Yes, we did it with zero seconds. Did we actually do it? We cleared it with no time left. That was so close. Oh man, not an easy one. That is for sure. But we found a way through. <laughs> oh my gosh. So that was our eighth story, right? Our seventh story. That means that we have three more left to go. Was that too easy for you? Well then. Things are about to get less easy. <laughs> that was not too easy for me. That was actually way too difficult, but we found a way through and now we're moving on to our next one. So, eight story crowded kitchen, collect all the something. I don't know what it was, Um, treasure, okay. Looks like we're not starting with any Pikmin, but there's plenty of Pikmin in here. So let's go ahead and send you out there. And then, oh, not the Pikmin, do that. There you go. And that seems like a pretty productive way to get it going. Maybe we could, Ooh, do that, that felt pretty nice. Um, so I destroyed some sticky mold that way. I think what we'll do, yeah, let's go ahead and get our white Pikmin over there and get Ochi to deal with this. Come on, together, together. Because inside of here, we got a couple of these gold pieces. Yeah, come on Pikmin friends, just, no, work on this. This thing right here, come on. We can do it together if you need, need us to, but so silly, so silly. So we got all that, this gonna be one, two, three, four, five. Hop on to Ochi to have them break through all those pots. Inside was a bunch more white Pikmin that I'm just gonna keep them busy over here. Just like that. I have a lot to do over there for sure, but in the meantime, Ochi can gobble this up. Um, I'm trying to think about the order of my tasks, so if I could just grab their attention, if not anything else, to so just 50 Pikmin for that? Okay, can't do that one just yet. Never mind. Um, get that over there, we'll call over any idle Pikmin because I really need them to do that, but purple Pikmin are coming up, so that's the big thing. So we're gonna ride Ochi again. Ochi we just keep busy, sort of, forever. I don't know where these guys are running off to. Okay, over there for some reason. I just need, let's do five for now. Okay, well that's all we really can do. So hop on top of Ochi, charge this and go boom. Excellent. Um, Call these Pikmin over and we're just going to do what do we want? Um, I think Ochi for that one. That there. And then I do, of course, see this. All the purple Pikmin coming together should be able to make that lower, which is great. I'll call over those Pikmin. We'll get Ochi and some of the white Pikmin to work on this. And then don't forget these guys. Okay, that seems to be a good idea for now. But what's the deal with this? How many Pikmin does that need? Not entirely sure. I'll call a couple over so that we can try to work on this. Or maybe it just doesn't work that way by getting this mixed up. I guess I just have to go around on the other side. Um, here, we'll do this. Get the purple Pikmin to work on that, but, or the white Pikmin, so that the purple Pikmin, we can get one there and then one here. And a few of them actually might be a difference maker. Ochi, do you wanna help with this? That'd be great if you could. So we're gonna get them there, the one, Purple Pikmin that's over here, just to get them the help on that would probably be a big deal. Okay, Idle Pikmin, whoever we have, get them over here so that everybody can get working. Looks like Ochi's keeping busy with all that. Doesn't look like there's anything left that way, so it's all down this other direction. So, we are gonna lose our Platinum time here in a moment. Very unfortunate, but what more can I do, you know? So, I'm gonna get that there. Looks like we're sort of fresh out of um, stuff in some ways. Okay, Ochi. I have you here. You know what I need you to do? I need you to walk over there. No, no, come on, you can do this, you can do this. Go over on this side. We're running out of reply and I'm timing. It's not too big of a deal. Um, Whatever stray Pikmin that we have though, we need to stay busy. Ooh, I don't know if we'll be able to do this in time. It's gonna be really, really close. Um, Okay, Ochi, yeah, what we'll do, reorder all this. Have Ochi pick that up, have just about everybody else over there, except for um, two purple Pikmin there. And then hope that that is enough. With 12 seconds remaining, it is going to be absolutely a close one. I don't know if we'll be able to do it in time. Ochi, I guess you could just uh, help out with this. It's not gonna be enough, unfortunately. So, so close, but we're not gonna be able to do it in time. 
But I think we learned a couple of things from that. And we can maybe improve our order of operations a little bit. We were so close to getting it done, so you're not gonna be happy, I know, I know. I'm very disappointed in you. All right, restart. So we're just gonna give it another go right now. Let's hop on top of Ochi and immediately break these open over here. Then I hop off of Ochi, hop off of Ochi, because every second seems to matter for this one, so I'm just really trying to not waste any time. Uh, so if you do that, you know, it's something. Then I have Ochi deal with that zucchini. And maybe I could just throw in a couple of punches. Anything to make a difference, right? Okay, good job, Ochi. I wanna charge up. Try to destroy a good couple of those, and that was actually pretty nice. Okay, the sticky mold has been removed from over there. But we almost got this one. And then maybe just the same deal over here. Luckily, Mo Mochi, or Ochi, does a lot of good work with that, but I want to, I guess, hold on. How do you guys deal with that? I want to charge through a bunch of this, then I'll have Ochi do that. All over all these purple Pikmin. It's sort of like a power in numbers at the moment, so I'm just trying to get them all to do that. Feels like a good idea, and then I see a couple more purple Pikmin over there. So yep, I wanna grab all of them. There's just so much going on here at any given moment of time, so I could just call them over two. And this is where I definitely need five white Pikmin. Turn into the purple Pikmin. If I could just hop on top of Ochi so that we can do this, that'd be great. Okay, Ochi on one, I guess. Actually, instead of doing that, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're still one purple Pikmin though. Okay, a little frustrating, but it's okay. I'm gonna ride on top of Ochi for the time being, just so that I can do this. And then I definitely need Ochi to work on this one now. So I will just have him go over there, call these Pikmin over, call them over too and send them over there if we can. Then yeah, we'll, we'll just do whatever we can with Pikmin over here to get them all boosted up. Very nice, very nice. Call them over again, because we just need one there, one there. Should do the trick. Okay, so call everybody back over one more time. Have Ochi deal with that. Run some Pikmin over this way, even if it is just a full set working on this for now. It might just be what we need to do. There's a lot of Pikmin just chilling out though, and that's where I just need to call them over. We still have a minute and a half left over, so we are definitely being more productive than last time. I just wanna make sure that all of those guys are nice and happy, keeping up with things. And it looks like Ochi can go around from the other way, so let's have them work on that. Purple Pikmin are doing that stuff. So this is where we're getting super duper close. I just need to hop off of Ochi. Hop off of Ochi, there we go. Um, and then do that. What else is left? I think that's gonna be it. Oh, that's another treasure over there. I totally forgot about that one. Oh no, I think we'll be okay though. So they're working on all of that. We'll run over here as fast as we can. I know it's not much, but with 45 seconds remaining, we have a lot more time. Uh, let's go, go, go. And then I'll just have Ochi help with this. Just everybody chip in a little bit. Because this is the last treasure, which means if I can just get Ochi to do it just like that, that should be good. Ochi's sort of the fastest way to get the uh, items moved with his little walk, so adorable. Um, nice, that was pretty productive. It's still only gonna be a bronze. I don't know how people do this faster. Like, how do you get a platinum in this? beyond me. <laughs> but there we go, that gets zipped up. We have 10 seconds remaining, so that's it. That will be the eighth story completed. Awesome. All right, so with that one, of course, got all sorts of little rewards. Okay, and well, like I said, we didn't have too much time left over. Okay, so that means that was our eighth story. I'm guessing that there's gonna be 10. You know, five for the white, five for the purple, so that probably means we have two more stories left to go. Hmm, you've passed. I will be waiting for you at the next trial. All right, let's head to it. Ninth story. Okay, so for this one, we need to defeat all the creatures. 
I'll start with this, um, oh, over here, it looks like there's a couple of things. So if I could just, boom, get you like that, and then just beat you up as much as I can, that's at least a start, but I need to be careful. What I'm supposed to be able to do is do that, and then all the rock picking are supposed to, oh no, not good. Supposed to stay on them, but it doesn't really work that way. Okay, one more time, one more time, boom. This is our best chance, come on. Couple more bites, should do the trick. That's our first creature. And we learned from last time that we don't really need to do anything with it. We don't have to excavate it. I don't know what's gonna be inside of here though, and I'm really curious. Is there anything in here that will actually help us? Um, okay, spicy nectar would definitely make a difference. So we have that, one enemy defeated, five more left to find. Um, I guess we'll do this, because purple pigment would definitely be useful. Um, so they're gonna throw themselves at that wall. We'll get five Pikmin out of this. And then, what is going on over there? Very empty room, which has me concerned. The five purple Pikmin, everybody hop on, go, go, go. We have a time limit here. Is something gonna jump down even better or even worse? We got this big blue bird. Come on. So you try your, okay, really? Come on. There we go. Boom. That should make a big difference. And then, Okay, got a lot done there. Gotta wait for you to pop back up to three and a half minutes now. Cause I can do this, it just doesn't do much and then I'm losing the pigment. So yeah, probably I'm getting a little impatient with that. They're losing the feathers though. Oh my goodness. I was hoping they want it. Ooh, pop back under. Okay, so when they're popping out of the dirt, that's sort of my opportunity. Able to defeat you, which is nice, but I guess I can get five more purple pigmen. Is that really worth it in this situation? I guess we're gonna find out. Um. Let's grab them all. Come on. They need a second. That's okay. Oh no, it's a glob monster! Oh no, how did I not expect that? Uh, come on, come on, come on. Not good, not good. Shake it off, shake it off. Oh, this thing is so scary. It's a lot like the final boss of Pikmin 3. I don't know what to do here. I can't get them. Here, charge. Boom, that didn't do anything. I don't remember how to beat this thing. That's my problem right now. Um. Oh, there we go. Come on. Somebody, anybody, rip that thing out. There we go. And then just fight this thing as much as we can. Come on. If we could just do something like that, that might be worth it. It's calling over all of its friends again. Ugh. All right, come on, get out, get out. I need to learn how to fight this thing effectively. It's been a long, long, a long while since we've last fought it. This doesn't really help, but gosh, this is like a timed boss rush in a way. Come on, stick out that tail again. Here we go, here we go. Come on, that's gotta do something. Should be able to rip it out there. And then, everybody's gonna hop on it. I'm gonna charge it as hard as I can, boom. And then just throw a couple of bites in. Man, it has so much health. It's so close, but I need to back everybody up. Oh, this is the worst. Come on, Ochi. Come on, everybody, get out of there. It's gonna go off again. I don't even know, yeah, I don't wanna do that. That'd be bad right now, because I wouldn't have the right stuff to move past that wall. I don't know. Boom, gonna do that. Everybody's gonna hop on top, and I will just try to bite away at you. There we go. Took a while. I don't think it's gonna be fast enough to break through that wall. It'd be better to go this way. So, we'll charge through, and then yeah, there's you. And this one's gonna definitely take me over a minute. This is not gonna be easy. This whole mission, I could already tell, is gonna be a disaster. I mean, luckily this guy's a little bit smaller than the ones we're sort of used to, but that didn't freeze you and you just squished all of them. All right, well, yep, it's over. We'll need to take a look around. Um, there's that guy, and then I think there's like, yeah, two of these big grubs. But then I think that's, oh, there's more rock movement over here. Okay, so, lesson learned. I think I know how to better approach this for next time. So let's try it again. Ready and go. So I'm gonna do that. I know that there's a big grub over here. If we tackle you, we can defeat you pretty fast. And I can maybe just get a couple of bites in, boom, enemy defeated. So I grab all these, grab all them. We need to start with another tackle. That was not good because it jumped at the same time. Really didn't do us any favors. Boom, gotcha, now defeated. Then we can go and tackle this wall, boom. That's gotta do something, they'll break it open pretty fast, right? There it is, there it is. So we'll do one, two, three, four, five. I think that would be good. 
because it's this giant goo monster that is definitely a problem. So if we could try to fight them sooner rather than later, maybe that's a better idea. I know it's gonna pop out. This time I'm prepared for it, so at least we'll have a little bit of extra time, because purple Pikmin are definitely a good advantage for that part specifically. And then we can just charge it like that. So I don't think we can like, yeah, we can't attack the goop or anything like that. That's not how that works. So I'll do that. We'll call everybody over. Up on top of Ochi, move it. There we go, we still have all 20 of our Pikmin for the time being. I don't think we'll get any more. As soon as that tail sticks out, we gotta be ready for it. Okay, there. It's gonna do its thing. I'm trying to be ready for the charge. Right there, okay. We just throw everybody over, and I think we got it. If we can just all, oh, it's gonna be close. It's gonna be so close. Ooh, come on, yes, that's perfect. Very big risk there, but very big reward. Um, and I think we will just do one, two, three, four, five. We still have, you know, three more enemies to defeat. The next one's gonna be the big bird. Come on, got it. They're all popping out. They're gonna get over here. This big old bird's gonna pop up. I just gotta wait for you to do your thing. Ooh, not that one. Come on, come on. You know what I want you to do. Here we go, here we go. Ooh, boom, hit it with everything I got. Come on, we might be able to get it in one go here. We definitely got it a lot lower there. There, got it, come on, come on, just a little bit more, are you kidding me? Okay, it's going back underground. We got it this time, two and a half minutes remaining. Gotcha. Get everybody over. I don't think I need to do any of that. This guy is sort of more of a threat than the, the spiky porcupine, so, uh, yep, I know. Uh, what I don't like is that we have to knock people back for that to work, you know? And the last time we did this, yeah, we just needed to call them over like this. Okay, yeah, that, that's gonna make them all panic, it's okay. So we call them back over again. I'm just gonna have Ochi go over, and then if not anything else, it might serve as a distraction. Gotcha, okay, very nice. That means there's one enemy left with two minutes left to defeat them. I think this is actually where we wanna go on Ochi. Dodge those, hit you from the side like that, and just have that do its thing. Ooh, watch out, okay. Just gotta be careful of those spikes which they only have one little set left, so we boom, hit you again, and we just start chomping. We do whatever we can with that, and it might be enough, it might be enough. Come on, come on, just a few more seconds left before, boom, we got it, that's it, we actually got a platinum for it too. Awesome. We didn't get the spicy nectar this time, but hey, who needs it? I guess I don't. All right, so a minute and 31 seconds left. That was the ninth story turf turmoil completed. So will there be a final story waiting for us next? I guess we'll have to wait and see. Mm, you've passed. I will be waiting for you at the next trial. All right, let's proceed. So we have it right here. We gotta get the purple jewel part of the final story, the purple key. Please show me your skills. For this one, we just need to find that purple onion. So this is very exciting. We need 100 Pikmin for that. So I'm guessing purple Pikmin will be our goal. What do I, I had just heard something. What did I hear? I don't know. Ah, uh, oh, it's the goo monster. That's not good. We got the Hydro Jelly Burst. We have 25 Ice Pikmin at the moment. I just don't know what we're doing here. Oh, I see you rolling over there. This is horrifying. All right, where will this lead me? Right over here so we can hop on top of Ochi. Fantastic. I see a couple more Pikmin, and there it is. Uh, but what do I do to get it over? You know? I'm not quite sure. Hmm, the purple jewel of the earth. Glorious, is it not? Carry this to the end, and I shall bequeath to you, uh, to you as a reward. Move quickly, or you will run out of time. I will move as quickly as I can. So, I need 100 Pikmin for it, so that's just not even gonna work. I have 30 Ice Pikmin at the moment, and this guy is rolling around like nobody's business. Okay, you do that. This one requires 50 as well, so still out of luck for that. And then if we could just... Break that open, what do I get? Some purple Pikmin, what do you know? We only get three of them for the time being though. So I gotta move it over here, and then boom, got that, cool. Um, I would like to get as many Pikmin bloomed as possible, so this is definitely not a bad idea, but that stuff is terrifying. No, did we lose one? I think we might have lost a couple of Pikmin. 
They just didn't follow me over here, which is such a shame because I need as many purple pigment as possible. But if I could just fight you off. There we go. Um, and then maybe I could just freeze you. I would like that, but not quite gonna work out straight away. That's okay. We just get another set of purple pigment over here. And then I just throw over as many as possible. They really don't like that. And when I do this, it doesn't keep them away forever. But if it could just keep them away for a little bit. Come on, come on, come on. I know I gotta consult my map. I guess while I'm doing this, I should have OG do something else. Uh, come on. Because the sooner I can get rid of you, the better, right? That doesn't really work that way. Okay, Ochi, I don't know what you're up to, but just keep doing it, I guess. <laughs> the poor guy. Come on. Okay, come on. A little bit more is all we need. We just need to instantly call them back. That's how we get the health lower. There it is, you're defeated. Maybe that'll be better. We get a little bit more nectar here, there, everywhere. We have eight purple Pikmin. And I am very worried that we just won't have enough to do everything we need to do, but for right now we can just do this. I don't know what's gonna be in here, maybe some spicy nectar. So you and Ochi must work as a team, I'm really trying. And that's gonna require some rock Pikmin, which I don't see around here at all, so. Let's go ahead and do that and do, uh, no, 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 this. There we go, that's enough, luckily, that we can just get through. So we needed at least 10 purple Pikmin. Can't do that. And that's not gonna do no enough. I mean, what if I did Ochi like that? No, 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 it just does not work, okay. Um, I know, I know, call everybody back over. Guess now it's not the time to experiment, but I just wanted to be extra sure. Um, okay, so they're gonna keep jumping out of that, aren't they? This is sort of a mess. Uh, trying to just them all to do with that then, and then have everybody go in there. Come on, hop off of Ochi. Keep trying to tell them to do that over and over again. It just doesn't always work. There we go. Dirt Mount Excavation dealt with. We needed to do that one way or another, but the problem is we only have a minute and a half left, and I feel like we're just really, really running out of time. So, if I could get past these enemies, that'd be great, but I don't think I have the opportunity to do that, so I just need to chomp through this one a little bit. Ooh, come on, everybody, come over here. Boom. Come on, get you as much as I can. That's two enemies defeated, and that's gonna lower the wall. So I did need to do that regardless. We will send a bunch over. Come on, Ochi, please. There we go. Uh, ah! Okay, um, I was out ready for that, but we'll just throw over as many Pikmin as we can. Got it, got it, got it. I think we got them all. Um, I need to do that. Oh, I froze my purple Pikmin by mistake. That's okay, they can keep working. Once that wall is dealt with, what do we do instead? Oh, this guy's not fun. So I could just go around them. I'd be really happy with that. Okay, you, right over here. Boom, I put a stop to you, right? Maybe, at least for a bit. I hope that my SP pin are okay over there. They are, it's fine. Um, no, 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 come on. Gotcha, excellent. We have quite a lot of Pikmin here, but I need more. And even if I did this, I only have 15 seconds left, basically. It's not enough. Because I still need to actually get the purple onion to where it's supposed to be. Yeah, this is not gonna happen, but at least I learned a good thing or two from this, you know, the, how the setup whole, the whole thing works, so I'm hoping that uh, I'll be able to defeat the big goo monster faster next time, and maybe that would help me get through. Man, that is tough. Okay, so you're gonna be really upset with me, but what do I do about it, you know? You know, fret, failure can be used as strong motivation. There's only one thing you can do. Keep trying. Okay, this time you were nice. You weren't just like, oh, very unimpressive. I appreciate it. So I'm trying my best. Let's find this purple jewel. Okay, grab all those guys. Rush over here and immediately break this open. Come on, I know, big scary man is coming through. So come on, keep at it, keep at it. And I will throw in a couple punches too if it makes a difference. Awesome. More Pikmin underneath all that, so definitely worth it, and then not too much more I can do on this side. So we're just gonna go through as soon as possible. Catch up with Ochi. And see what we can do beyond that. Um, first off, this is gonna be grabbing these Pikmin. I'm not gonna dilly-dally going over that way because I already know. But I just won't too much. Okay, I see you over here and I'm hoping that I can just distract you well enough. Seems like it worked. We got a couple of purple Pikmin out of that straight away, which is always great to see. 
And then right there. That's gonna give us a couple bits of nectar. And then try to do this a little bit just to see what we get out of it. Ooh, I'm a little scared. Luckily, we're fine. Um, and we got all these purple pigments. So this is where we have to fight you. We, I think we just have to, right? I mean, I think it would be logically a better idea than if we didn't, you know, so. But now we know how to fight you faster. We throw the, you all on, and then he's gonna cry about it. And then, oh, watch it. No, come on, get out of here with that. I mean, we lost less from this fight than we did last time, so that's at least good. Come on. Still just sort of a bummer. Okay. Pop them all over again. You get back here, dude. Because I just don't know what that was gonna happen if we uh, let him get away. Okay. Come on, keep it going, keep it going. We are so close to getting you, but then they, they knocked us back there pretty big. Come on, just a little bit more. No, this one, this one, this one. There we go, there we go. It seems silly to do that, but I think it'll be worth it. Hop on top there. Now I don't have to worry about this wall either. I forget what was on the other side of that, but maybe not anything too important. Um, this was sort of a problem before, but do I really even need to do that? I'm trying to figure out how do we bring the onion back? It might have to be through all of that stuff. So that's where I get really nervous that like, yes, we do have to. There we go. Um, hop off of Ochi. Crazy how many button presses that require sometimes. Come on, Ochi, Ochi. Get in there and start taking. You're the, you're the best stick out of the group or not. You just didn't feel like it. Okay, come on. Hop on, keep it moving. And try to deal with this guy. Come on, bite, gotcha. Call them all over, charge up again, and boom. That's gonna be an instant frozen. Got it, okay, so that should be all of it. Obviously, if we can get some extra nectar, it's always good too. Two minutes remaining, very stressful. Ochi, want the ice pick them too, or the, not the ice pick Oh, you guys, you guys, you guys, I totally forgot, again. But this time we didn't really lose any, so that's great. Oh wait, no, no, no. Just the ice pick then. Hop on top of Ochi, get over here, avoid the big scary enemy, because why would we need to fight them? We don't have to. Okay, charge up, charge up, avoid that. Boom, hit you with everything I got like that, and then just chomp. Come on, come on. I call them over, but I should just be good with that. Excellent. All right, getting down to a minute remaining here, so we have a lot more time than last time. And this is gonna get us over 10 purple Pikmin, so that should be enough for our onion. So, I got all that done. I just need to, no, no, no. Do that. Cool. So what I think would be the most time efficient thing to do here is to go through this way. Ochi can't join us, but we can just tell Ochi to come here through our command. So, we do this. We've made a full circle now, right? That's what we had to do. So, command Ochi to come here. That'll make sense, I think, more later. It's just not a lot of time here, and it just gets very stressful. So there we go. They're all gonna do that. We can throw some more Pikmin to maybe speed it up. Oh, and there's enemies popping up! Are you kidding me? 30 seconds remaining, I just don't know if we have enough time. My thing is, how do I break this wall? Okay, we don't need... Where's, where's Ochi at? I don't know. Oh, wait, would it have been faster? No, no, okay, it's not really too much of a way. So with 15 seconds remaining, I don't know. How would we break this? Do I have items I could be using right now? No. So if Ochi can't do it, I don't know what would have broken that. With five seconds remaining, though, we're sort of just out of luck. That was closer, but not close enough. So definitely a shame. I don't know what I could do to make it better. So the one thing is I just got the, the gooey guy completed and then I wanted to get Ochi to just carry it over. I feel like that might just be the better idea, right? And then we'll just try to destroy these guys as much as possible, just like that. Get them all into there while Ochi is carrying that purple onion over. That might be the better way to get this done. So that's destroyed. 
Yeah, anybody who needs to bloom to keep blooming. Like maybe that's actually the real strategy here. Um, and then try to fight you off like this. And that seems to be working decently well so far. I don't want any of them to get torched. It's a little frustrating that, you know, they're so close together this time when they weren't like that before, but. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Almost got you frozen. Then I can get everybody's attention and just full send them over there. Come on, come on. Come on, come on, are you kidding me? Keep sending them over. Purple Pikmin, do your thing. There we go. So we're still sorta of kinda of running out of time here, but what I can do is at least get over here, get all that dealt with, have all 30 Purple Pikmin deal with that now. And we're at one minute and 15 seconds, so we're getting a whole lot closer, but I think this is maybe our best chance of getting this done. Come on, come on. I don't know where our Purple Pikmin are now. I think they're actually frozen. Uh, which actually has me a bit concerned. Okay, you guys keep going. There we go. Um, so, what I think the best way to deal with this guy is, is just doing that. Oh no, come on, come on, come on. No, that better not defeat them. It looks like it hasn't, so that's good. Come on, we have 49 seconds here. So if I could just go over here and then, boom, do something like that, that's not so bad. Um, what I need to do then is run Ochi back over there and then do that. And then what did we need for this 100? So we could, in theory, just do this. Whatever's gonna be fastest, it looks like this will. So it seems like Ochi carrying it and then us guiding him throughout the whole thing is actually the strategy. With 25 seconds remaining, we should be able to do it. Okay, that's it. Wow, that was tough. But once again, how to do this as a platinum? Not for me to worry about. I don't think I ever wanna try. I'm happy with just what we did there. So there we go, final story, the purple key captured the purple jewel. We had a whopping 16 seconds remaining. Awesome, so yeah, I think we did really good there. And we finally got the purple Pikmin onion. That's amazing, that means that we can actually get the game 100% complete now. It does only work. I believe there is nothing left for me to teach you. Use these jewels, the purple onion and white onion I bestowed upon you. Now you must walk your own Dandori path. Nicely done. Now you can easily increase both your purple Pikmin and your white Pikmin populations. So um, I've been wondering about that leafling zebra. Do you think we should try to bring them back to the surface and cure them of their leafiness? Out of the question, you won't be administering a cure of any kind. I have no intention of leaving this place. I may not remember who I was or where I am from anywhere, uh, from anymore, but it's no matter now. I'm content with my way of life. It brings me joy. Please, just leave me in peace. This one seems different from the other leaflings. If they want to stay here, then we have to respect their wishes. Understood, Captain. Well then, time to head back, Zebra. You would go without collecting your rewards? These jewels, the white onion and the purple onion, please take them with you. I'll be here, as always. I hope to see you again soon for some more training. I hope so too, but that is so interesting. What makes them different from the other leaflings? That they can speak in full senses and are basically fully coherent in that way. Maybe they've just spent more time as a leafling that some of that kind of stuff comes back. All right, so pretty late in the day, we finally complete the mysterious cave and get both the white and purple onions. How exciting. All right, so as you can see, our first edition right here is the white one. Boom, looking good. I never imagined it would get this colorful. Me neither. But here comes the purple, which should be our final upgrade. Ah oh, man, I can't believe it. Here we go. Boom. Now that is a colorful onion. What a fantastic array of colors. Now the onion can propagate any type of Pikmin. Well, except for glow Pikmin, but they're their own special thing. So there we go, the expiration results for day 45, the trial of the sage leaf going amazing. We get all of the 10 stories done, some better than others, but still completing them, so I'm happy with that. And that means the day's all wrapped up. You are one top-notch explorer. Aww. To think that a wise and reclusive leafling was underneath the rescue command post this whole time. Aww. From what I can tell, if you decide to enter that cave, you won't emerge until nightfall. Aww. Hmm. That means you won't be able to explore any other area later that day. This is a good example of how the art of Dandori is also crucial to your work as a rescue officer. That's right, 
make sure you take care of your any outstanding rescue tasks before entering that cave, Zebra. Well, I think we got it done. And as you can see, that really just means we have one more treasure left to focus on in investigating the planet. There are many things on the planet you've got to, many things is just one thing, I suppose. And then I guess some side quests. I mean, especially with Louie, how to find t four dwarf bulb orbs. Um, and then everything else is gonna report back, I think. I guess we'll have to wait and see. Very curious for sure. But I guess we'll get a little bit of a better idea with that on rescue mission day 46. So yeah, that was fantastic. Definitely took a lot of work, was not easy in the slightest, but the mysterious cave is completed. And we have more waiting for us here, I guess. That's why I'm a little curious just to see like what really is left. I think that there might be some missions around here that we have now made progress with, with getting that onion. I need to earn up some purple Pikmin so we can get that last little bit of treasure. And then maybe there'll be like an extra 100% ending. We can maybe recomplete the game. I don't know, we'll have to wait and see. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Pikmin 4. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, bye bye.